what a difference a DAC makes. A DAC or DAC stands for Digital to Analog Converter and that is this right here. I have the Cambridge Audio DAC Magic and I want to show you essentially the difference in sound between just a plain digital stereo audio reproduction and an analog audio reproduction through the DAC. Now, for if you're wondering why I have two Apples here, the after upgrading from the Apple BDP83 to the Apple BDP93, I use the 83 now because the Apple is still a superb disc player. So what I'm doing now is I'm using the Apple BDP83 as a CD stereo player. So the way it's set up, I'm gonna come around back, come around the back. I have the optical cable coming out and it goes into the back of the Cambridge Audio DAC Magic. The DAC Magic transfers the audio from digital to pure analog stereo and then outputs it via analog connections to the Integra DHC 80.2 processor which is below and then of course the processor sends the audio to the amp and then the amp puts out the music. So, and one of the best things about this is the pure mode, which I'm going to show you soon. It's the pure mode, it eliminates all electric activity from the screen and directs it to the internal audio circuits. Okay, so I have a disc in there right now. I'm going to hit the pure button on the remote. You see the screen, all, 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 all the, the electric activity, it leaves the screen. All you get is a pure, well you can't make it out with the camera, but yeah, that's the word pure. So every electrical circuit inside is being routed to the audio processing right now. So let's go do a difference in sound with this stereo production using this in stereo mode through the DAC or in regular stereo mode on the BDP-93. We'll see which one's better. Now the heartbeat of heaven, let us hear. We feel the rains of your love. We feel the wind of your spirit. Now the heartbeat of heaven, let us hear. That's the BDP-83 in stereo through the digital to analog converter.
It still sounds great, but it's lacking a bit of depth. BDP 93 digitally. All right, so in summation, I definitely prefer the BDP 83 for stereo CDs um, as long as it's going through a good DAC. Uh, the Cambridge Audio DAC Magic is a pretty good DAC. And um, I would definitely characterize the BDP 93's stereo CD playback as more laid back. The the bass is definitely less prominent than than through the DAC with the BDP 83. Um, I don't know what magic that this DAC is doing, but I was very skeptical before I purchased it, and after I purchased it, all my skepticism went out the window. So yes, all in all, BDP 93 digitally is gives you a more laid back. Still, it still sounds amazing, but it's definitely more laid back, and the bass is less prominent as opposed to the BDP 93 using a DAC. The bass is more prominent. It's rich and it's tight, and it still sounds great. Now this is just for CDs, compact disc. I'm not this I'm not, I'm not this video is not about SA CDs cuz that is a it's a whole separate story. So this is for a compact disc. All right, which still sounds magnificent. All right, that is all.